This is a walkthrough video of 5311 Levi Lane. We're basically at the corner of Honore and Levi, just south of Proctor. Uh, the highway is not too far over there. This is actually a nice little neighborhood. Um, it's just a dead end street. All these homes were built right around the same time. This house is a REO, it's a foreclosure. It's not terrible though. Um, it is, uh, you know, it's, 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 I believe this. Yeah, this is a block home. Um, so I walk in through the side here. It's got the garage over there. The kitchen is, is uh, it's a solid surface. It smells like dead tenant in here. You know, the usual smell. Um, you know, it's, it's actually, and this would make a great little rental property. I gotta say, just change out the carpet. You know, the kitchen is adequate. Um, but you could spend some money and make this place nice because there is a lot of uh, new construction. There's a new DR Horton development just to the north of us. And uh, it's a big garage. Look how big this garage is. Fabulous. Um, yeah, the water heater looks to be in good condition. Uh, this AC, you know, I'm sure these two are original. I got to look at the day of the house. The Washer and dryer hookup. This is carpeted out here, which is kind of yucky, but uh, what do we got here? Panel looks to be good. Uh, newer panel, bike rack, pegboard. It's awesome. Okay, so let's walk through this house here. This tile in the kitchen is, I mean, like I said, I mean, this would be a great rental. Uh, it, it, it's, not, it's not my usual REO that's gross. I mean, yes, this carpet is gross, but carpet is gross to begin with. So there's nothing new here. Um, you know, this is all a little dated for a DLP TV. Um, you know, you might want to update that. Definitely give this place a paint job. Get rid of these blinds. But, you know, sliders are in good condition. Needs a little landscaping. I'm going to go out here. Let me see if I can... I hate these things. Oh, the doors open nicely. So I got a little screen lanai out here. Um... Look at that house. It's very nicely kept. They have a pool. It's really nice in a little cage enclosure. So, like I said, there's a little swale there, and then we're back up on those new DR Horton homes, which are selling in the uh, fours and I think even fives. So, so this is a pretty desirable area. Okay, let's check out the rest of the house. This is the master suite, and this opens onto. Man, this is some gross carpeting. How does the carpeting get so gross? They must have had a bed here. How does it get so disgusting underneath the bed? That's gross. I mean, that's the original carpet color. Look at that. That's, un that's unbelievable. I said it looked like a dog living under there or something. Kind of smells like it. Yeah, definitely. Definitely dog. Okay, master bath. Um, you know, it's, it's pretty junky. Nice walk-in closet. A little commode. Got some water damage back there, but it's just really just that trim piece. I think that could be rectified. You know, tile in here is actually pretty good. I mean, you clean that and maybe regrout it, but I don't know. I mean, you could almost salvage all the tile in here, aside from those water stains, those rust stains. You got LED lights up there. The ceiling looks to be in good. Did, no roof leaks. Not sure what happened here. So that's the master bedroom. Now I'm gonna go into, I guess this is, you know, with these, with these French glass doors, what is this room? Let's figure it out. We have a sink and a closet. How weird is that? What the hell is this? A shower? Wow. <coughs> interesting. Well, interesting little nook here. And then bath, toilet back here. A weird linen closet. Huh. Wouldn't, I guess I'd call this a bedroom, but kind of like a, its own suite. Very weird. It's very awkward. Who, who does that? So anyway, that's, a, that's weird. I don't know what I'd call that. I mean, is it a den? It's not a den. It's a... It's a very weird layout. So you basically have these two bedrooms, both with their own bathroom, no guest bathroom. Um, 
I, I'm going to say that's going to be a challenge right there. Um, two bedroom, two bath, but weird. You know, I looking at this again, I can't quite figure out. And they must have had a bed here. So this was used as a bedroom, but with those glass doors. I don't know. I gotta think about this one. And this weird double vanity. Did the other, and the other one had a double. So it's like it's got two master suites. So this one had a double vanity too. Huh. These are just things that make you go, huh. Anyway, um, it's interesting. I like the location. I don't know if I would... Um, can't get out here. Oh, it's locked. That's why. Um, I don't know if I. I don't know. I'm really torn on this one. Huh? Even as a rental, it's only two bedroom. No way to really rectify that either. I mean, I wonder if you could make a third bedroom. That would be cool if you could. I mean, you have the sink over here. You have the shower and the toilet there. That's really weird. You got this weird thing. Hmm. I don't know. Well, I got to think about this one. I'm Jules Roman with Yorkshire International, 941-366-0000. And as always, thanks for watching.